Hello folks, it's uh, Mark here, your favourite technophobe, bringing you an online uh, TRX bite size session, so TRX at home. Uh, and the reason being, I've got some absolutely huge news for you, and that TRX is returning to Five Sport and Leisure Trust in the new year. So, which means I'm returning as well. So, on the Thursday, the 20th of January, get this on your phone, at quarter to ten, uh, will be the first TRX class since March 2020, so almost two years. Exciting news, can't wait to get started uh, and see everybody again. So there'll be 22 spaces, um, so get yourself get yourself booked in, uh, get your space and we'll try and get that class filled up and we'll, we'll get back to it. Great news. Um, in the meantime, got a wee refresher for you here, a wee bite size session, jog to memory, get back into doing some of the moves and hopefully get a wee bit of sweat on, work your muscles, uh, so before we start, the usual stuff, we'll have a wee look around, make sure your area is clear. Okay, because we're using a suspension trainer at home, you have to make sure that your anchor point is nice and secure. Okay, so the door's not, if you're pulling against that, the door's not going to open in on you. Okay, so nice, nice and secure, give that a good, good yard there to make sure. Okay, so clear area, anchor point, trip hazards, we're good to go. So it's just a quick session, uh, some basic basic moves to try and do upper body, lower body, finish with a wee bit of core as well. Okay, so try and give options, we've not got a long time. Uh, also, you would you'd obviously do like a, a thorough warm up before going straight into this. Okay, so let's get started. So the first exercise is the close grip chest press. Okay, so you're going to have to take the, the straps to long length. Okay, so we're just going to take that down. We're facing away from the anchor point. Okay. We're just placing the straps underneath the arms here, underneath the armpit. Okay, so it's nice and close. The hands are on the outside. Long length. We're going to place the hands side of the body here. Keep okay, straps tight. We're going to take that step back. And from there, it's a close grip. We're pushing back. So that would be option one, especially if you've not done this in a while. If you wanted to get a wee bit more, you could go a wee bit steeper. Okay, keep your core nice and tight. We're going to do that standing plank, remember that? Uh, and we'll get going. So we're looking at about 45 seconds each for each exercise. Okay, so close grip chest press, triceps are picking up a lot of the slack here. They are supporting quite a bit. Keep it that standing plank as well. Okay, so we're breathing out on the exertion, driving back, keep breathing in on the way forward. Okay, so the handles are wanting to move around a wee bit there, just keep your core nice and tight, try and steady that. Check time, bar one, for once. Okay, so close grip uh, chest press, working the triceps, chest, core nice and tight. Going to switch to the legs now, okay? So we're going to go up a bit to about mid length. Mid length on the straps. And we're going to work the lower body, your thigh. We've got here as well, mainly hamstring. Okay, so reverse lunge. Just stepping back here, trying not to use the hands and driving up, okay? So you might. Option one, you probably want to do alternate sides uh, the whole way through. Uh, for this circuit, I'm going to do one side for 45 seconds, then switch to the other as well. Okay, right, let's go. Losing time. Stepping back, and we're driving up. Okay, try and push off the front foot. You really want to get to that thigh muscle. And the glute as well here. So try and not push off the back foot too much. Again, try and use the hands. Using your hands, that's cheating. Okay, we're really driving up. Controlled on the way back. And driving up. Good. Okay, we'll get two more. And last one. Okay, right, we're just going to switch over to the opposite side. 
try needing that up. And we're driving up. So a bit controlled on the way back, up a wee bit quicker. You try to use the hands. Or the back foot. Good, keep it going, keep it well, you should feel that in the thigh muscle, the lead leg, and the glute as well. Okay, try and get two more. Last one, drive it up. Okay, we're well done. So, it's the lower body taken care of for now. Uh, we're going to switch back the upper body, you might find you're a wee bit breathless using loads of muscle groups there at the same time, so um, good bang for your buck. So we're going to take that up to short length, okay, we'll just take the straps up. And from there we're going to switch back to the upper body, so we're going to work the back and biceps this time. This is one of my favourite exercises uh, on the TRX. So we're going to keep the core nice and tight as well while we do this. So option one, it's been a while. I'm just step forward a little bit, core nice and tight, stand in the plank, and you're pulling yourself up there. Straps are tight the whole time. If you want to get a wee bit more, let's go a bit steeper. Okay, two, one. So, okay. so we'll go a wee bit steeper. Remember, you're not stuck here though. Say you do five, six, you're really struggling, just come back a wee bit. Remember your standing plank. Keep your elbows in. Last wee bit, we've got another two or three. Okay, one more. Okay, well done. We'll just walk that back. Okay. We're done, folks. So back and biceps. Core nice and tight as well. I'm going to give the upper body a rest. We'll switch to the lower body again. We'll just take that in a wee touch. Maybe a tip at mid length. Maybe just above. And we're going to go for a squat. Okay. Basic movement. Option one. And we're up. Okay, you've got the hands on the handles here. You want to get a wee bit more for it, slot it in. One, two, three, up fast. Okay, that would be option two. Option three is a squat jump. Okay, you might start with that. 45 seconds is a long time. Might end up going into a normal squat. Okay, three, two, one. Let's go. 45 seconds. It's a wee jump. Remember, this is an advanced option. It's only 27 seconds. Wow. You can feel that in the legs already. It's getting burny. Heart rate's coming up. Last wee bit, folks. Nearly there. Five. Two, one. Oh, oh, nice burn in. Feel the heart rate up as well. Well done, that's great. Okay, so we've come down there. Well, we'll still be at mid length. We're going to finish with an exercise once I catch my breath for the core. Okay, so we're going to try and really get into the obliques here. Muscles at the side, we'll do one side at a time. So this is a classic hip drop. Okay, whoop. So hip drop, hands just above the crown of the head. We stand right underneath the TRX. Straps are tight. You're going to take your weight out to the side and back up, okay? We'll do one side, then the other. So let the straps take your weight. Feels like a nice wee stretch and then, bam, <laughs> stab. We still have pain in the side. Okay. If 
fantastic exercises. There's no many to get into that area. Wait like this one. If you could get the grips with it. Check time. 10 seconds, we'll get another few in. Last one. Right guys, we're just going to hey, relax here. We're going to switch into the other side. I'm going to be a wee bit rude. Turn my back to you. Sorry. For the last exercise, okay? So we're going to even that up. Opposite side. Nice dog posture. Don't look at your feet. Last one. Well done, well done. Oh, hi. Check time. Okay, guys, well done. Fantastic effort. Thank you for joining me for uh, that quick bite size workout. And um, remember, uh, Thursday, the 20th of January at Carnegie, 9.45. Get your space booked, TRX. Have a great Christmas and New Year, and I'll see you then. Thank you.